everyone, have you ever felt the need to gloat? Oh, I certainly have, especially after my epic battle with the frog known as Frogger. And you know, today, I'm going to do the equivalent of dancing on Frogger's grave by playing another one of his abominations. This should be fun. Frogger Beyond, released in 2002 for the GameCube and Xbox, and later in 2003 for the PlayStation 2, but only in Japan for some reason. I guess they haven't realized the true horror Frogger can bring upon a society. Anyway, in 2002, the Frogger franchise was in a weird spot. Frogger 2 Swampy's Revenge had resurrected the Frogger franchise back in 2000, and then Frogger the Great Quest came along in 2001 and destroyed any respect that anyone had towards this franchise. Not that they should have, for obvious reasons. So this game had a lot riding on it, so let's see how it handles that. And diving headfirst into the gameplay, thank god this isn't a 3D platformer like Great Quest. Instead, this game took a more classic approach to the gameplay, modeling it after the original game. However, they did add some hip 3D sections, like, oh my god, Frogger's rail grinding. Oh yeah, dog, that's what I'm talking about. And other than that blatant Sonic Adventure 2 ripoff material, there isn't too much to say about it. Anyway, throughout the game, Frogger will jump through several themed stages, such as Basic Swamp, Mountain, and Blade Runner. Yeah, I've learned that it's best to accept the weird things in this franchise and move on. Each zone has three normal stages and a fourth special stage reserved for the... Boss? Now, these boss fights aren't that hard, but dear god, they're long. The very first boss fight took me over seven minutes to beat. I could have made a couple things of macaroni and cheese in that time, but no, instead they made me fight the Dollar General version of Donkey Kong over here. And, getting off of that, let's talk about the story. Now this game's story centers around Frogger, obviously, but instead of subjugating mankind or considering sexual assault like he did in Great Quest, he is instead trying to become a teenage frog, and in order to do this, he must go meet with the Frog Elders and pass eight different trials. Yes, I just said Frog Elders. I really don't know anymore. Anyway, the Frog Elders make Frogger traverse several different realms in order for him to properly become a frog teenager. Presumably, they just hoped Frogger would die in one of these realms so that they didn't have to deal with him, but whatever. Anyway, once Frogger comes back to the Elders, they induct him into the Order of the Frog-Shaped Demons, with his one goal to be the establishment of a frog-dominated world, and... Oh, wait, no, he just becomes a teenage frog. Yeah, both are pretty bad in my book. Anyway, Frogger Beyond was received fairly well upon its release, receiving an average of 60%, which sounds pretty bad. However, you have to remember that the previous home console Frogger game was Frogger the Great Quest, which received an average of 30%. Anyway, I think that about wraps up the game. Let me just check my notes here to see if I forgot anything, and I forgot to mention the Frogger rap. This demon really does do surprising things sometimes. And that was Frogger Beyond. A pretty, a pretty average, average platformer with, with some weird Frogger oddities. Mainly the Frogger app. Man, it feels really good to kind of criticize a Frogger game without Frogger coming after me. Are you sure about that? Oh, oh my, my god! god! Couldn't have been real. Just couldn't have. I, I destroyed Frogger. Oh, maybe it was just a bad dream. Oh, well, it's time to go play another game. Oh, that's weird. It's all Frogger. Alright then. Guess I'm not playing another video game. 
Oh, that's all right. I got a fine collection of board games right here. Oh, no. Oh my god, that's a long way to run. Wait a minute, what's that? Miss me? I won't lie, not particularly, no. Look, buddy, I'm gonna have to thank you, because when you defeated my initial form all those months ago, I was able to revert to my initial form, my most powerful form. I'm not for long. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you won't be able to do anything to me now. I am powerful. I can do anything I want. Huh. <laughs> it's time to form this world into one of my own making. <laughs> Ah! <laughs>